pans and pioneers. Thanks everybody for joining me today for this video. Today I'm going to make La Madeleine pasta salad and if you've ever been to a La Madeleine restaurant you'll want to grab this recipe. It's a great take along to a friend's house or you can keep it in the refrigerator all week long. Um, you'll just love it and it's super 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 easy. Let's get started. Okay, so what I've done here is I have some boiled pasta. Um, I use the Whole Foods brand of Farvel, and it's completely organic. That's the whole point in having uh, this YouTube channel is I want to show how easy and economical it is to eat organic or more healthy foods. So I've got the boiled pasta in the bowl, and I've drizzled some olive oil to keep the pasta from sticking around. Um, this is not whole wheat pasta, but you could use that if you wanted to. So what we're going to do is just collaborate all the ingredients together, and then um, we'll mix it, and then we'll see how it tastes. So I'm going to add a half a cup of uh, spinach that I've chopped up, and we're just going to just dump everything in the bowl at once. And I've got some sun-dried uh, tomatoes, and this recipe is going to be on my blog, so you're going to be able to feel free to uh, go print it off, or you can join us on Facebook. It's also on that one. So we're going to put that in the bowl. Um, I've salted and peppered some Roma tomatoes, and um, I always try to get a lot of the juice off. There's a little bit of juice here. I'm going to get that off real quick. But you're going to put Roma tomatoes in there as well, so two types of tomatoes. Here is the Parmesan cheese, and it's like eight tablespoons. You'll have to go look at the recipe to find that out. And I've got some dried celery and dried parsley and dried onion. Now the recipe calls for fresh onion. Um, my husband is allergic to onions, so um, I have to use dehydrated products. So I'm just going to sprinkle that in here. And then I put um, fresh fresh mozzarella in here. The recipe doesn't call for it, but I really, really, really like it in this pasta salad. It's just an add-in. And it's just a, probably a half a cup of mozzarella. And here is some fresh uh, basil, uh, pesto. Well, pesto is basil. So it's just garlic, olive oil, and basil all chopped up together. This is all organic. and you're going to want to put in a half a cup of Caesar salad dressing. Now I make my own Caesar salad dressing, I'll do that in another video, but um, you can buy this at a Whole Foods or Sprouts or any kind of organic store, um, or even make your own if you see it in my video. So I'm just going to add in the Caesar dressing. And you're just going to mix it all up together. Now this is best served the next day, but you can certainly dig in um, once you have everything incorporated and mixed up. This salad is pretty pricey at La Madeleine. Um, I make it at home all the time and put it in the refrigerator and you can eat it with sandwiches or you can even try the whole wheat pasta if you want to even knock it up a notch on the healthy side. You can use light versions of salad dressing. Just know anytime you alter the recipe you're going to get a different uh, version. That's going to taste a little bit different than La Madeleine. You could add uh, shrimp in here uh, that's been sauteed, or you could add chicken, or even turkey. I've tried turkey and it tastes really good. So all you're going to do is put this in a container, and I recommend that you let it sit overnight before you eat it so that everything can marinate in here. But it's delicious, and I know everybody's going to love it. Super, super easy. Um, depending on how, what versions of ingredients that you do in this uh, would count for your calories if you're trying to, di to diet. So anyway, it's really super yummy and I hope everybody will try it. Have a great day. I forgot, let's try the pasta salad before I let you go. It's really, really yummy. Let's get some of the pasta. Get my mouth full here. Mmm, this is so good. I love La Madeleine pasta salad. If you don't have a La Madeleine near you, you can taste a little bit of Texas. Uh, the French Bistro here, La Madeleine restaurant. All you need to do is go to my blog and print the recipe. 
you can find us on Pinterest and Facebook. So I hope you'll subscribe. Click the red button down there and subscribe to our YouTube channel. I'll come up with way more videos. I'm going to make sure it's all organic. And I'll be able to help you uh, being a mom of 20 years single. I know what budgeting for food is, and it's so expensive to eat healthy sometimes, but I'm going to show you some really good tips on how to do that uh, economically so that everybody in your family will benefit. So come back and see us. Thanks, everyone.